What it do, No Chefs? It's your boy, No Chef DJ, and I'm bringing you all a taste test of seasoned catch, low country style shrimp boil that I got here from Food Lion, as you can see. <laughs> uh, let's get into it. So this is the packaging. It says you can cook it in the bag, in the microwave or the oven. It comes in a bag and it has shrimp and corn and sausage and potatoes and onions. So we'll see how it goes. This is the instructions and how it looks on the inside there and then some nutritional facts and all that jazz. So the cooking is pretty simple. So I'm kind of looking forward to something simple like that. So if you do like simplicity, this is probably the seafood boil for you if you're into it. What to do, no chefs? So as you all see, I have this pre-packaged, pre-frozen seafood boil that's supposed to be some low country style cooking here. So we got some corn, some shrimp, potato, onion, and sausage. I'm a little nervous to try it, but I'm gonna try it out and see how it tastes. It smells okay. Um, I know they do put some flavoring in it, some lemon and herbs, and they got onions in there for flavor. Uh, let me grab me some water first, just in case. All right, I'm back. I got me some water so I can wash this down in case it's terrible. Here's to praying that it's not. Oh, uh, before we get into this, though, I'm gonna go ahead and pray for this. Dear Lord, in the name of Jesus, we ask that this is delicious. I ask and pray that whoever packaged this and froze it did a good job. Whoever seasoned it did a good job. And I just ask that you keep the heebie-jeebies away, he away. And I um, hope this is good. All right. Without further ado, let's try it out. So the shrimp did shrink. So these are very small shrimp, if you can see. They're not very big. Oh, I'm nervous. Okay, not terrible, but okay. I'm gonna try some potato. They have red potatoes in here and some onions. Let me try this out. Mm, it tastes like a standard potato. Some things are cooking a little unevenly because you put everything in there. So I think the potatoes are a little mushy, but they're not bad. Let's try some of this sausage. Sausage is very 
peppery or something. Hmm. But not a terrible flavor. And then they have this corn, which is supposed to be charred and, you know, whatever. Let's try that. Not bad. Um, let me try a few of these things together. We'll do a potato. There's a potato, a sausage, and a shrimp. Hmm. I mean, altogether, this is not terrible. I wouldn't buy this again. But it's not awful. It's not like the end of the world. It's definitely different, though. I mean, it's, it makes you skeptical because your seafood and seafood boils seem like such a, there's such a method to making it. And you want it to be made with love and be in, in care and in, in care and and you want it to be like all well cooked. So I mean, if you're into this kind of stuff, if you're into a quick meal, if you're into frozen foods, if you're into you know stuff like that, this might be for you. But if you're into like if you grew up with authentic seafood, like fresh seafood and fresh produce, this might be a little bit subpar. But the flavor's not bad, so I give them I give them a five out of ten for everything they did. I think the flavor's not terrible. I just wish the sh you know I'm just used to a different caliber of shrimp. You know, like these are a little tiny, and um, the sausage is really spicy. But overall, I'm not mad at them. They did a fine job because this could be way worse than what it is. It really could. So, so yeah. Um. Yeah, like I said, it could be way worse than it is, but I gave it a 5 out of 10, so it's not winning, it's not losing, it's just right there. So I'm sure this will come in handy for someone who's who doesn't know any better or who just doesn't care to have, like, quality, you know, seafood. Um, yeah, before we end this, give this video a thumbs up, hit the bell to be notified, and like this video. Give me some comments down below if you've ever had one of these. Uh, prepackaged frozen seafood boils. If you like them, what other brands there are, where you found these. And I found the this one at Food Lion. Uh, it was like 10 bucks, which is actually not, the price isn't bad for what you get because you get, you can feed two people with this, I think. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching y'all and be good.